Hi, Mr. Simon here. Let's learn this chapter, Matter. Okay, so um, there's solid, liquid, and gas. I'm sure you learned this before in your lower year. So uh, in the exam, if they ask for solid, so they ask you to draw maybe one or two marks, what you have to do is you can always draw complete circles like this. Okay, I would advise you to draw four by four. Okay, complete, you see? Complete, okay. Here, about the same size, and this will be solid. Okay, if they do not give you the box, you just draw this thing. Okay, so uh, do not do this. A lot of students, when they give you a box, or if without box, so they oh, I keep on drawing millions of it. Oh my god, okay. So there'll be too many in this wrong. Okay, then also try not to draw uh, big, small, different sizes. Okay, as another representation. If they ask you solid, done. Okay, so once again, four times four or three times four is good enough. So then they will ask you uh, two or three marks in the exam. They ask you, so what is the arrangement? So you can say, oh, they are arranged in a fixed position. Okay, so this is a lattice structure. Okay, when you see the word lattice, you know, like a like a three D shape. So when they arrange nicely, this is called lattice. So all solids have a lattice. If you look at your textbook, you can see something like this, like a three D box thingy. Uh, this is like this okay uh, and then they ask oh what is the motion of the particle so all these particles here are vibrating do not write not moving okay must be uh, they are vibrating at a fixed position so all solid they're actually vibrating like vibrate vibrate vibrate, vibrate. okay get it uh, so and another thing they ask oh so what is the forces among them so I try not to mess this up. So between this, there are very strong forces. So is it strong forces to hold them together? Okay, and move on. Ah, liquid. If they give you a box, liquid. So imagine like all liquids. So they're all sitting at the bottom, but then it's very random. Very random here and there. Okay, like water and liquid. Okay, you can draw like this. Got it? So if they ask oh, what is the arrangement, so you said oh they are arranged close CS okay close together okay and then what is their motion? So another mark explain what is the motion they slide over each other. Okay, uh, then if they ask oh so what is the forces among them? So you can say oh so between these guys here, so as they say these three forces very strong. Is only two so you can say weaker than solid okay so that is the force uh, next one you'll be gas if they ask you to draw gas and all just draw you know very random they are moving here and there okay so you see i try to draw complete circles with the same sizes okay uh, some some of your teachers are very particular make sure you draw it properly Okay. So, uh, what happens for uh, gas? They ask you to explain their arrangement and then the uh, motion. So you said they are very far apart. Okay, one mark keyword exactly like this, and then they also move very quickly. Okay, among each other. Got it. So if they ask what is the force, uh, why are they so far apart? Because their force is very weak. So it's among the weakest of the solid liquid and gas okay so uh stay tuned for the next video thank you